Hi Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn Earth Signs. Welcome to my channel. My name is Chelsea. In this reading, we're going to find out what's coming up for you within 24 hours. To book a personal reading with me, all information is in the description box below. And today is the 3rd of May, 2023. Time here in Bali, Indonesia is 7.13 p.m. Please bear in mind that this is a collective reading for Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. If you were to finally guided to watch this video, this message is meant for you, even if you're dealing with the same sign. All right, now let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me for Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn what's coming up for them within 24 hours. There will be a lot, of, uh, a lot of details in this reading, may or may not resonate with you from the beginning till the end. Okay, got these seven of pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Hmm. There's one individual here, Nine of Wands, a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, or a Leo. You find an, one person, an individual here, showing to you, Five of Swords here, lovers that um that they don't want to play games anymore right six of pentacles in one verse there's some sort of an action may or may not say it but through their actions this person's action that you like because the nine of wands is moving towards here to the left and eight of cups is also in one verse so it feels like there's someone coming back telling you that okay they don't want to play games anymore or through their actions as though they are not um, feeding another person they're not concentrating on anything but you it's almost like them choosing you two of wands in one first so this individual is gonna express to you it could be directly or indirectly again through actions because the nine of wands is the nine of action so um the swords are in my first, so it makes me feel like maybe most likely this person is gonna show you interest, is gonna show through their actions that they're choosing you, they want you, they're passionate about you, or they desire you. If this is someone um, romantic, okay? Mm, if this is a romantic situation, and judgment here is in my first, two swords in my first, again, Two twos in reverse indicates a choice, a uh, choice being made. So someone is going to make a choice to choose you. And the judgment in reverse, when that happens, you will be wondering if, you know, if this is a good idea. Seven of Pentacles, you may stall a little bit or that you still, you will continue to observe this person's behavior, eight of wands in my verse, maybe this is um, a stagnant energy or that at one point in time, um, maybe you and this person, maybe this person didn't show that much interest or it's almost like a build up. That's what I'm seeing here because eight of wands in my verse feels like, like a bit of a delay. It's not that this person was never desiring you. They were. They, they still are, but they could be slowing it down, okay? And the Four of Cups here in my verse, can indicate this person doesn't want you to be a missed opportunity. So they may, again, through their actions, show to you that they care, they want you, they desire you, they're passionate about you. They may also tell you something, a judgment in my verse. Yeah, I don't know. I just keep getting like, maybe they'll say something, but... They'll show it more through their actions. Like they did something wrong. Um, sort of admitting it indirectly. I hope that makes sense. Because the seven pentacles, it's like, you know, these pentacles are hidden. So it could be their hidden intention, which is to actually show to you that they care. They want you. It could also, it, it can be anybody, yeah? Um, could be a friend. Some of you, it could be, I feel like for most of you, this is a romantic connection, but about 30% of you, this could be a friend, okay? 
So we've got the Knight of Pentacles here, King of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, Page of Cups in reverse, and we've got the Strength here in an upright position. This person could be a Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, or Aries, um, Sagittarius, Leo. Some of you could be in a same gender relationship, not all of you. And then we've got the Strength here for me indicates this person see it feels like they're gonna show you something but they're also holding back from making it look so or too obvious or not wanting to seem too desperate page of cups and one first it feels like a roundabout they may say to you something but it's not very clear right seven of cups it's gonna leave you feeling like is he or she trying to say what i think he or she's trying to say <laughs> But use your intuition most likely whatever you're suspecting that could be it okay the knight of pentacles page uh knight of pentacles and the king of pentacles these two cards here for me definitely indicates that this person is going to show to you how sincere they are how they want you or how they want to be a part of your life how they're committed to you or how they want you to commit to them goes both ways the strength here it's it could be part of their strategy they could be um either this person is very careful with what he or she is about to say to you uh or through again it's like through the actions that's what i'm seeing here because look the swords are in reverse see nine of swords here in reverse so this person may have been thinking a lot about it and then may have with the strength here just um trying to be very diplomatic about the whole thing and finally offering you something that is solid but again swords in reverse either ones in reverse they're not good they're gonna beat around the bush right you you i think you're gonna get it but at the same time you're gonna be questioning like is that what are they trying to say is this what this person is trying to say to me right i'm not 100 percent sure with the page of cups here in reverse I guess spirits could be saying just play along, right? Uh, with the strength here. Hmm. Let's see a little bit more. Strength also can indicate, sometimes it can be a bit of a, you know, it could indicate physical intimacy as well. Some of you within 24 hours, you might get a bit close to someone. You could be physically intimate with someone. Hmm. Either this is someone who is returning or someone who is already in your life right now, or the Seven Pentacles is someone you may have found, right? Out of the Seven Pentacles, only one pentacle is outside. So this for me indicates some of you, it's someone you have found um, or met. Some of you, this is someone who is already in your life because the Four of Cups and the Eight of Cups here is in reverse. Could be someone returning as well. The, the strength here indicates some sort of a physical intimacy. So you're going to be intimate with someone. And the Seven of Pentacles is like watching, watching as well. So maybe you, you could be watching a movie with this person, Netflix and whatnot. Because it feels like it's like um, coming to a house, like indoor. Although this shows like it's outdoor, but with it being reversed, it feels like it's indoor to me right now, okay? Some of you might go out with the Four of Wands here. And the full and rub first. <laughs> so you're just gonna be letting your hair down and have fun. Mm, Seven of Cups could be enjoying drinking, eating. Um, yeah, if that's what you're gonna do, Spirit says, you know, the strength here don't over drink. <laughs> don't over drink. Especially because all these cups can make it drinks and food so it could be over drinking most likely it's over drinking or over eating but the cell cups is also like you know someone is kind of like dizzy so be aware as well the page of cups in reverse nothing i'm seeing here if you are going out within 24 hours you're going to be surrounded by people make sure you don't leave your make sure you don't leave your cup or your glass unattended okay See, the Page of Cups, this person is supposed to be hold. it's in reverse. So that means you, some of you may, may leave it unattended. Don't do that, just always hold it with you. 
because seven of cups i'm afraid someone might spike your drink that's just for some of you okay in terms of money in terms of career i see you planting your seeds some of you are just going to be planting your seeds working really hard nine of pentacles and the king of pentacles trying to achieve some sort of a stability in your finances mm. Look at the nine of swords in similar verse. Again, this character, this person may show you through their actions that they're choosing you, that they care, they're committed, but not actually saying it, okay? Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn, this is your reading. I hope you resonated in some way, shape, or form. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Feel free to subscribe to my other channel, Chelsea, Tra uh, Chelsea Vlogs. It's my travel channel. I just posted a... Uh, short yesterday check them out um, I'm in Bali right now so I, I like to go out alone doing things alone by myself so that shorts is um, just to show you what I do whenever I'm alone when I go out on my own but anyway take care Virgo Taurus Capricorn hope to see you back here again later or tomorrow bye